A 10 kilogram rock at rest is broken in only two pieces by a small explosion. If a 6.8 kilogram piece of rock flies to the right at 12 meters per second, what is the velocity of the other piece of rock? Given in the box and shown in the diagram, the original mass is 10 kilograms and its initial velocity is 0 meters per second. After the explosion, the mass of the first rock is 6.8 kilograms and its final velocity is 12 meters per second. What is the mass of the second rock and its final velocity? Shown in the red box, the original mass is equal to the mass of the first rock plus the mass of the second rock. Therefore, 10 kilograms minus 6.8 kilograms is equal to 3.2 kilograms, the mass of the second rock. Shown in the green box is, is the important law of the conservation of momentum where the momentum before the explosion has to equal to the momentum after the explosion. In the blue box, we can see how we're carefully isolating the variable of the final velocity of the second mass. Substituting all our units in, we come to the point where we're solving the equation in the orange box. The final velocity is equal to negative 81.6 kilograms times meters per second divided by 3.2 kilograms. Our final answer of the final velocity of the second mass is negative 25.5 meters per second. To do our unit check, kilograms times meters per second divided by kilograms is equal to meters per second, which is the unit of our final answer.